Right. What happened? No, just, um, Again? Don't do the door? Oh my god, it's like seven not times. You, oh. I'm not talking to you, relax. Uh, you live okay. up in Boston, seems like you'll come through. So you tell me I got some spots to take you to, so. This is your first time in here? Yeah. Okay. So we're taking around the sneaker channel, right? Yeah. Yeah. So I got the oh, Travis no. Fragment Lowe's and uh, 11 and a half. You know anyone who want to buy them? I'm 11 and a half. No! no! Stop! Oh, uh, yo! Yo, I am so hungry, man. We just got the Uber, man. So I'm gonna go in this spot and get something to eat. Look, like we just spoke to a bodega. Uh, I don't know what they got inside. It looks very beer, man. And then after that, we're gonna find some sneakers to get into. Let's get, let's make it. Hey, yo, my man, can I get a Sprite? You got any Sprites? Soda? Can or? Oh, we got the two liter orange <laughs> We got the orange soda. <laughs> I like those fours though, but they're not real Jordan fours. I forgot the name of them. Yeah. No! Yeah. Yeah. Son, they are attacking us, dude. I'm sorry. No, I, no, no, no. Oh. I heard it. I'll speak to them about the coffee. That's what I'm It's high, man. Do, um, no, protect the experience. Protect the experience. I would do the same thing. You guys have, like, you have the releases just. Get your seconds right. You got the Air Jordan 1 Miz, man. The blue and white joints. This remind me of... I don't think... I, oh, yeah, I have seen these. These are like the hologram joints, the black and white. Then they had this and just a black and white. I think they're doing, doing a better shoe, in my personal opinion. These are the new Air Maxes joints. That's different. You got the Air Max 1s. Better quality leather. I like the swoosh around the, the toe region. That's dope. Oh, they got the Clarks, bro. This is another New York uh, thing right here, yo. Pass times, 250 though. They guacamole. They just had a New Balance drop today, but we came too late. It was first come, first serve, and it sold out. I don't even know what that collab looked like, man. So I wish I did so I could show it to you guys. They don't have no more pairs. We got the Ninja Turtles joints right here. <laughs> we got the Michelangelo's, yo. What's that about, yo? What's that about? Oh, I like these New Balance. These 92s. They're tough, yo. These are tough, I like them. Um, I don't have New Balance in the collection. I need to though, especially in Boston. I think uh, the, the headquarters is over here, right? New Balance? Mm-hmm. Here goes your Steve's right here, Rich. Man behind the camera. Oh, the damn, boots. those are the... And, and they got the yellow and outsole on them too as well. Wow. The so the NS Prime Nick. That one is Mega Man or the Sonic? Yeah, Sonic. Tough. I like that as well. Purple and black. I don't know if I got anything like that color. Yo, I don't know about you, but I'm not a fan of pockets on tees. But it's not my Steve's, mm -mm. yo. Yeah. Like, what can you even put in there? Like, you know, you know nothing. <laughs> corduroy pants. Yo, I'm looking for some a corduroy fitted hat, yo. I don't know if you've seen them. They had a drop. It's a company, but they're on IG. They had a New York fitted corduroy hat. Dope. Sold out instantly, man. I was gonna fly to New York just for that drop, but it said it was releasing a hats online. But the boss ate them, man. But yo, if you guys are familiar and know anything about it, man, hit your boy up. I'm looking for that New York corduroy. Um, it's dope. But anyway, so anytime I see corduroys um, outside of pants and shirts, I like like maybe a hoodie, a hat, or even some basketball shorts. That's that's unique, right? You ever seen a pair of corduroy basketball shorts? Never. So I like to see unique pieces like that. Five seven fours. My man's right. Come on, baby. My man's right. It's my favorite Yo. shoe. That's not a Adidas or a Nike. It's not a Boost or a React. This place is dope. I like it, man. I like it. What's your thoughts on it? Hey, don't break my arm. What you think about this spot? Hey, yo, everyone. You already know. Six or weapon. Get to the point, bro. We don't need your intro, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Put it every time. Nah, I mean, yo, keep the fit. Uh, yeah. I like the store, man. What I like about the store is that it's got a vibe. You know what I'm saying? You come in, you relax, you talk to everyone. You, uh, yeah. you know, this is a great place to be. I feel you, man. I feel you, I feel you. Just don't record the door. They told me 17 times, don't touch the door. That you actually, gotta protect the experience. Actually, it was 19. It was 19. It was 19. I got Miss Cow. You're talking to the dog whisper right here. The dog whisper. Uh oh, uh oh. Uh -oh. I did a lot more American. It's my first dog, so. Really? Yeah, my first time. If you don't mind me asking what you're feeding it. 
Um, just the four. The right hey, four sweetie. Days. You want it wet food or dry food? I got. I put water in the food. It make it to, softer to make it a little too. softer. It's, uh, the diamond dog food is good because it's high in, uh, in proteins and okay. per fat. So the high the protein for puppies is, is ideal. Yeah, it makes sense. Yeah, right. So that's probably the, my best experience of 12 years uh -huh. raising puppies. Just diamond dog food. food. That's kind of now. And it's something I can find. Like, I don't know. See, I'm from uh, up in Florida. Okay, okay. So that's where I grew up. We're actually Florida. working on opening up in Florida soon. So hopefully that works. Really? Around. Yeah, Bro, you know, that's what's up, man. Um, I, I got a dog a long time ago when I went to college, but uh, I'm trying to get back in. But it's, for me, I'm so involved. It's, it's hard for me if I have find a breeder. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Someone mess so with I got anybody. it with a breeder from Georgia. Okay. And then um, went down and got her. That's what's so up. Was, this is my like fourth day. With so you her. actually went and got your dog? Yeah, So yeah. most people send them on carriers. So I, I like the, I like that person. I want to see yeah, where, yeah. how you raise your dogs. Mm -hmm. You bred it too, so you got to see the parents. Exactly. Yeah. That's what's up. That's and, um, what's up. Yeah, I've, I've been falling in love with them. But we'll, we'll bring you over here. <laughs> but yeah, okay. I, I do a YouTube I'm channel. It's called Ball on the Budget. So, oh, uh, Ball on the Budget, though. Yeah. Well, you came to the right place. We got you know? something for everybody that's here. We got up. pants that's like $35. We about to get that. that we're, we're, audience, yo, we're, we're, talking, we're about to get the first YouTube plaque, man. We, we, we ain't no, you know, we ain't no 50 Ball cases. Ball on the in. Budget. I Ooh. like it. I like Ball it. Ball on the Budget. That's as real as it gets. Yeah, exactly. Exactly. I like it. The concept started when I was like, I was going to I'll play ball, I was gonna buy, you know, Jordan's. And I'll start paying 190, it's like- oh, You can come in, it's all right. Oh, you're gonna have to be a No, no, no. Oh! Or try to be a film student. Oh, you're a film oh, student. Oh, up. you know. We're just we, uh, uh, filming the sneaker. culture, you know? We have a sneaker YouTube channel. Uh, you can follow Ball on the Budget. We travel. I'll pull it up. Yeah, man. Uh, you should see when you're a film student, you said? Yeah, I'm trying to, uh, so I'm That's going into senior good. year. Of course, of course. I'm gonna try and go to a film for college. Film for college? Great. Yeah. You already have a camera and everything? Yeah, I actually just picked up a Black Magic Pocket Pro 16. Okay! Okay! He's ready! Yeah, He's so ready! It took a bit, but no, I got pissed off your mom with that. I am! <laughs> now you're gonna, have to, now you're gonna have to buy a hard drive for all that raw yeah. data, boy. No, 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 no. He bought like a Game Boy. No, no, no. Tell him all the stuff. I got a oh. uh, Zealand Crane 3. I got, uh, what was it? Sigma Oh, he went Oh, he oh, went head yeah, first. All out. He went head first! You know, he took a whole college tuition and just bought that. Yeah. <laughs> I, I went up from an A6. 6300 and it was just, oh perfect I, I that's love that's perfect i still got that but it can be a pain when you're trying to get like really nice stuff in you know what i yeah. mean yeah mm -hmm. especially with the, with the rolling shutter in 4k if i'm yeah, trying to get yeah, anything yeah. that's like not slow then you, it just it comes across pain like that so, so the next you know you said so the next the next question is the type of content you're shooting what is yeah it? what um, type of content so right now we're just doing like some short films throwing stuff together we actually we were on the, not. I'm <laughs> gonna, I, 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 I don't want that shit on the internet we, did, <laughs> <laughs> right. we, we decided to give like two hours to film a short film that i scripted called five feet under about a short hitman okay and, 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 so, <laughs> damn and then he pointed at him too damn Actor. He's a really good That's actor. what's up, man. Bro, you're profiting off of my life. I, <laughs> I, uh, we gotta have um, a contract. Yo, it's a wrap, yo. The only thing I got from there was some uh, some wipes for my kicks and whatnot. Yo, there was pleasant enough to give us some stickers as well. Met a met some great people in there, man. Had some great conversations, man. Uh, I guess was one of them was the GM. Then we had some kids that was walking by. They came in there and started telling us about their film. Uh, career and what they plan to do and their aspirations being in photography and videography. So that was dope, man. Dope spot. You gotta visit. There's a secret sauce to that store, man, that y'all gotta experience, man. So pull up to Bodega if y'all in Boston. Y'all here first. Ball on the budget. Salute to them. Bodega. And we out. Yo, Boston is beautiful, y'all. Boston beautiful should be his new name. I love this place. It looks good, yo. The floors are clean. Opposite of New York. All right, y'all. Sorry for this late upload, man. I apologize, apologize. Am I in frame, I focus? All right, that's what's up, yo. Yo, I enjoyed my time in Boston. I especially enjoyed my time at uh, Bodega. Had a chance to talk to one of the homies that worked there. I'm not sure if he was a GM. Don't want to mistitle him, but um, he was letting me know how long he'd been there and he's giving me a wealth of information, man. So salute to him, just having this a regular conversation. We chatted up about dogs. He had a little Staffordshire Terrier. Um, you guys probably don't know this, but back in the days, man, um, I used to raise pit bull terriers. It was a passion of mine. I was highly involved with the dogs about how to breed them, what to look for, what kind of traits you look for, and how to um, get those those traits. I mean, there's a lot of 
I mean, you can't, it's like trying to have a child with blonde hair, blue eyes, right? It's like impossible, you can't breathe for that. I don't care how you put the parents together. Well, dogs are similar, but a little bit more easier. There's something called a right coefficient, where the way you can calculate based on the two uh, dolls you have. Sir, Dane, about getting into technicals. So there's certain traits you look for speed, look for agility, look for size, um, color is one of them people look for. So I was really, really involved, man. To a point I had a website called Virtual Pedigrees. It was a database that housed American Pit Bull Terriers pedigrees, their lineage, um, all the way back from their ancestries, man. Great, 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 and beyond. And I extended that to like uh, working dogs, Rockwallers, Staffordshire Terriers, etc. cetera. Um, I spent I spend hours, 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 days, weeks, if you, um, accumulated all the time spent researching this data is probably years man um to make this database and webs and website i still have the data i just don't have the website but that said man that was that was a uh, past frank man now i moved on to you know collecting shoes and doing videos like this man which i documented i did but not like how i'm documenting my my journey with shoes but that said man i had some great great conversation even the kids that was walking by actually i think they pulled up to the shop there uh one guy was in film school or pursuing to be a producer at some point or some some facet in the uh, videography world he was asking questions because he saw the camera out uh salute to them if they're watching you know what i'm saying good luck wish you the best i have tons of footage of me just having just random conversation with people i'm not gonna bore you guys if you guys care to see or hear those conversations maybe i can put it on a different channel i have a few other channels i'm working on and maybe i can throw it on there for those who want that in depth you know sit down conversations man maybe it could turn into something maybe i can go to different spots and interview these owners or whatnot who knows i don't know making stuff up but that said oh i didn't get those uh travis scott lows man one, I was traveling. Uh, everything you s that I had in my possession was literally in that bag that I had over my shoulders, that backpack. There's more details on why I was wearing that backpack throughout all the videos. That said, I thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this. Got one more vlog left from Boston, man. I, this is a banger. You're gonna love the next video, man. It's, it's the essence of this channel. It's a Nike outlet, obviously, so stay tuned to that video. That should be up next. I think I'm like five, six, possibly seven videos in a row. Who knows? Who knows? Uh, if you like what you saw, uh, hit that like, hit that subscribe, hit that notification bell as well. And everyone, keep leaving those comments down below and your boy get back to you as soon as possible. Until then, until we meet again, you already know my slogan. Good to go. It's a wrap. Peace.